Hey, hello, Roscoe's Repairs here. Today we're working on a Gen 1 Prius. I believe it has a computer problem in the uh, hybrid battery. And I believe the problem is this, this thing right here. Because it's saying that I have a line snapped. And I've checked all these sensor wires all the way up to the other end. And I can tell you what the pinouts are of this thing. Um, it has 20 wires that go to it. But the problem we're having is we're getting the triangle of death because it's saying that the hybrid control system is having a problem. It also is saying that there's a line snapped, detected line snapped. Well, I know there's not because I double checked them all check the resistance you have to take them off in order to check continuing on the sensor wire um, the farthest connector away is the blue one then white and then red so they're all in order see this one's been spliced but it it works so blue white and then red not sure if Japanese knew that they were putting this in a red, white, and blue order, but they were putting it in blue, white, and red order. So I would say that the blue one's one, two, because the third one in is that red one. But then you got to remember when you flip this over, that obviously they're backwards from that because one would be here. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then it skips one. And that's 11. And then you got to go 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and then 20. Because 20, you'll notice, is this gray with a black stripe. And sure enough, it's first off the bus over here. The gray with the black stripe. And then purple. So let's, you know, verify that. So you got the gray one there and the purple one right there. And look, they jump. They skip one right there for whatever reason. But they also skip one in the middle. So be careful when you're checking. See, there's no wire going into that one. So that's when they go from like 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So good luck with that. Check your uh, wires and um, make sure they're not really a line snap. Because if there is, that's a simpler fix than taking this computer out. Because then you got to have a computer. So I'm going to go get a computer that I just happen to have laying around and put it in here and we'll see what happens. Inside the trunk of this Prius, we have to have a jumper battery because that battery over there is dead dead. But anyway, before you start taking this computer out of this hybrid battery, you want to disconnect your positive and your negative. Well, just one of them will do. But you want to make sure you don't jump these things backwards because, man, I'm telling you, if you ever hook negative to this one and positive to this one, you'll have about a five-hour job of replacing this main fuse. So don't do that. I've done that once, and it's not real fun. And then once you replace, once you uh, disconnect the battery, disconnect the uh, service plug. <clears throat> Sorry, didn't get to see that, did you? Disconnect that service plug. It's basically in there. You're going to pull it down, pull it out. I've already obviously done all the grunt work of taking the metal top off the battery, the hybrid battery. So you've got to unplug these wires so that you can take the computer out. This is the back of the computer here. A little clip on the back of this one. Clips right there on that one. You got to pull that back to get it out. So we got to take off these two screws and there's one in the front. So these two screws right here, there and down there. There it is. Yay. You can see it. I'm going to get my finger out of the way. So we've got the battery disconnected. Um, now we're going to go over here.
and we're going to unplug the orange connector. <laughs> That's a two hand job. You're going down for a second. Okay, that's out. Now we've got to get down to <clears throat> this wire down here. And you'll notice there's a 10 millimeter. That may be an eight or a 10. We'll find out here in a second. All right, it was a 10. And the ones back there are eights. So I'm gonna take this out. Try not to lose this nut. Now we're going around to the back. These are definitely eights right here. You can see that computer is loose already. Almost like replacing a motherboard on a computer. I guess it'd be more like a, a video card or something. All right, we're going to get this replaced, and then we're going to put another one in. It looks like in order to get this out of here, we're going to have to do some gyrating. Because you got this stud down here, so this has got to come straight up. So, goodness. We may have to remove some stuff. I had to do this in my son's Prius, my other son's Prius. He uh, had a computer went bad on him too. But So this is not an uncommon problem. There's actually a wire holding strap right there. You've got to unplug that. So just for fun, I opened up this computer and yeah looks like it might have problems more than likely it's got some issues you see all this burned electronics in here something's going on in here it's not working like it should have for sure so we'll get that other one and put it back in here this is nice to know there was a reason why nothing worked all right i put that computer in the hybrid battery and well i swapped it out and sure enough, there are no errors at all. So we're good. All the errors are gone. And have a great day. Fix it yourself. Save a lot of money.